Hi, this is the continuation of the lessons for the Lord's Prayer. It is our final lesson for this month, and it is for June the 25th Bible study for elementary. Our lesson for today is Ask and Receive. Our memory verse is from Luke chapter 11, verse 9. So I say to you, ask and it will be given to you. Seek and you will find. Knock and the door will be opened to you. You are going to do a fun word search about the Lord's Prayer. And then also we have another activity for you to do. And you will cut out each of the doors here. And each door says, one door says ask, the next door says seek, and the next door says knock. And you will be doing that with uh, the guidance of your parents. We have learned over the past month that we could be respectful and have humble hearts, acknowledge God's holiness, and believe he will answer us when we pray. In this last lesson on the Lord's Prayer, which was Jesus' example for his disciples and for us, we will learn why and how to ask God for the things that we desire or the things that we need. When we ask God in our prayers, we ask him for healing for a sick friend, uh, maybe for a need to be met, or for a desire that you would like to happen. When we seek in our prayers, we seek God's help, his grace, his forgiveness, and maybe help in being kind to a brother or to a sister or to friends. Sometimes God answers prayer and the answer is yes. Sometimes he might say, not now, maybe later, and sometimes God says no. We have learned that we should be respectful, have humble hearts, acknowledge God's holiness, and believe he will answer us when we pray. It's okay sometimes to feel like we just don't know what to pray or what to ask God for. Or to do because it doesn't matter because the Holy Spirit will help us and we don't have to be afraid to ask God for the desires of our hearts because he will answer according to his own holiness and his will the important thing to remember is that God loves us and wants us to make requests because it shows him that we know he can provide so when we pray, we can make our request with the full assurance that God not only is able, but he will answer our prayers. Let's pray. Thank you, God, for answering our prayers when we ask, seek, and knock. Help us remember to pray with thankful hearts. And thank you for Jesus' example and for his sacrifice. Amen.